I'm Jeff and I'm the head of sales here at Fred Olsen Cruise Lines. I'm here to walk you around one of the sisters that joined our small ship fleet last year. Come and join me and welcome on board Borealis. Okay, so we've moved inside now because we'll be taking the tour of the ship from the top down. But before we do, it's worth saying that each of our bars, restaurants and lounges are light, bright and elegant, each having been carefully designed. Now I'm here on deck nine forward in our crow's nest and this relaxed lounge is the perfect venue for either a pre-dinner cocktail or a post-dinner drink accompanied by our resident pianist. This is also the location for our popular traditional afternoon teas. Now as you'll see from the panoramic windows, this is also the perfect spot for scenic cruising. This is something that we feel passionately about here at Fred Olsen and our journey planners design routes that take in sights best seen by the water because we believe that the journey is just as important as the destinations that you're visiting. Now we've come down to Deck 8 and The View, which is our relaxed buffet restaurant. And it wraps around both sides of the ship and serves up dishes from around the world as well as your favourites. Now you don't need a reservation to come in here and as always, the dress code is casual. The first speciality restaurant we're going to show you today is Vasco, located on Deck 8 next to The View. Now named after the famous explorer, in here we'll be serving traditional Goan dishes. And I'm joined by Chef Malroy from Goa to tell us a little bit more about the menu. So Malroy, tell us a bit more about what we're serving in here. Uh, Fred Olsen Cruise Line has came with an authentic Goan restaurant menu. In this week, there was the Goan croquet, it's a mackerel croquet. Then we got the Sorak, it's a, a vegetarian curry. So for our passengers who are vegetarian, they can go for it. Then we got the dessert, it's a, like a layered bibinka. It's a bibinka, layered bibinka. And then we got the Firni, it's uh, like uh, rice pudding from Goa. That's excellent. Malroy, thank you ever so much for your time. We'll let you get back to work. Let's carry on with the tour. Now here we are in the Atlantis Spa and Fitness Centre, located perfectly on Deck 8 Forward, and what a room with a view it is. And with all the machines and weights and classes, there's no real reason that you shouldn't be able to work off just a little bit of that lovely food. Now on our port side, we have our hair salon. And yet on the starboard side, you'll come past a number of treatment rooms to get to the retreat. And in the retreat, we have dry and steam rooms with aromatherapy and of course these great heated ceramic lounges. Before we move on to see the rest of the public areas, I thought it would be nice to come down to Deck 7 and to the bridge. As a family run business with almost 200 years in shipping, it's fair to say that maritime is in our DNA and we love our smaller ships, they're part of the family. And our captain, like Captain Yozo here, know them inside out. So Captain, I'll be interested to know what you think our guests are going to love most about Boletta and Borealis. Hi Jeff. Uh, yeah, I am sure our guests will love something slightly different, a bit more spacious, and uh, with a couple of more venues for them to enjoy, and hopefully appreciate our uh, efforts in adding uh, the elegant uh, Fred Olsen design touches in attention to detail they're used to. That's brilliant, thank you. We've come down to Deck 5 midships and in the centre here is this spectacular clock that I'm sure is going to be an amazing photo opportunity for many. And just below me here on Deck 4 is our guest services and destinations teams. This really is a central hub of the ship with easy access to all our bars, lounges and restaurants. We've moved just a stone's throw from where we were to our ocean bar. Now this vibrant and elegant room brings with it an attention to detail that all our ships are known for. And this is a great lounge to come for either a pre or post show tipple because our show lounge is just through here. So let's go and take a look. Our two tier Neptune lounge has chairs designed so you can sit comfortably and enjoy a drink whilst watching the show. I'm here in our bookmark cafe on deck five. Unlike Balmoral and Braemar, this cafe library serves up delicious speciality coffees, freshly baked cakes, and handmade chocolates. And it's located in the heartbeat of the ship because next to us is a firm favorite, our morning light pub. And next to that, a new venue for us, the piano bar. And then last but not least, our speciality restaurant, the forest room with the menu inspired by our love for Scotland. 
Our main restaurant has two tiers, Aurora here on deck five, and just below me on deck four is Borealis. Great food is something that we're really passionate about, and it's a big reason that more guests come back to Fred Olsen than any other cruise line. You can also come here for an a la carte breakfast or lunch as an alternative to our buffet dining options. Some guests will be allocated their table in our Indian Ocean room. This is a more intimate room, yet with the same great menus as our main restaurants. Deck 4 Midships is where you'll find the auditorium. Now in this smaller theatre, guests will watch movies, listen to interesting speakers, enjoy wine tasting, or take part in cookery demonstrations. We'll also be hosting events where after leaving the auditorium, you'll join your speaker and continue the conversation over dinner in our new restaurant, Colours and Tastes. Let's go and have a look. So we're here on deck four in our Colours and Tastes speciality restaurant that has an Asian fusion menu. And with us today is our executive chef, Rudy. Rudy, can you tell us a bit more about the types of dishes that guests are going to enjoy in here? Sure. Um, uh, we've been sourcing some nice ingredients from uh, Indonesia, Thailand, Japan. We got all them on the ship. Uh, we're going to kind of make an Asian fusion with European dishes, mix them. And uh, it's going to be exciting. That's when the Asian fusion team came. And it's going to be wonderful on the plate. That's brilliant. Thanks, Rudy. You're welcome. I've quickly moved up to deck seven so we can talk about accommodations. It's worth saying that all accommodation benefits from our low cost laundry service or self-service laundry facilities. And all accommodation comes with the facilities that you would expect, including tea and coffee making facilities and three pin UK plug, two pin plugs and USB charging points. If guests choose an ocean view cabin, they will enjoy those views through either a porthole or a picture window. We have our terrace cabins that come with the added extra of outside deck furniture and privacy glass. And then of course we have our suites, our spacious suites that come with extra facilities and some grade of suites benefit from our Sweet Dreams package. And there you have it, many reasons that we're extremely proud to welcome Belletta and Borealis as the newest members of the family. And all of our ships are smaller than many other cruise ships and all designed with an attention to detail. We hope you enjoyed this video and from all of us here at Fred Olsen Cruise Lines, thank you and see you on board really soon. If you'd like to be in the know with the latest and greatest cruise deals, then be sure to subscribe and click the bell icon to receive notifications every time we post a video.